hello, my name is Malik Abrabia, and I'm the Vice President of Education for the Students General Association, or SGA. The student associations uh, really are the, the student advocacy. So we represent students in, in many different ways. We offer services like our health plan, uh, bus pass. Uh, we advocate for you um, uh, in, in our academic senate. So if you need a great appeal, uh, you, we're here for you if you need that. We also do promote uh, uh, student um, student services and uh, and different clubs and events that uh, that the student association basically will run. So, for example, our Frosh Week, uh, the sort of uh, first week of class uh, when you come in, especially as a first year, uh, it's we have a ton of amazing events set up for you. So think of it as uh, the university really sets up your academics but the, uh, the student associations really set up your student life for success. So uh, basically everything out of the classroom uh, or most things out of the classroom, we will handle for you. Basically how it works right now is that when you uh, first enroll for uh, classes, so that should be around the springtime for incoming students, um, it, it basically you'll have a questionnaire that asks you, uh, do you identify as a, uh, as a Francophone student? If you press no, you'll fall under the uh, Student Dollar Association, the SGA. Uh, and if you press yes, uh, then you will fall under the AEF. So really they provide the same services, uh, but, uh, but either in, in, uh, in the primarily French language or uh, English. There's definitely a lot of ways to get involved with your student association. Uh, definitely uh, join our board of uh, directors. Uh, I think that would be a great first step. That's what I did when I first came in. Uh, we do have annual elections for the executive positions, like what I'm doing right now. Um, and we also have senator positions as well. So uh, you get to really advocate for students under the academic purview of Senate. So you get to, you know, really make sure that uh, you're, you're representing your programs and your peers and make sure we get the, the best quality education possible. Um, but definitely outside of the, of the association, uh, we do have a lot of clubs that fall under our association as well. So we do have clubs day in the, uh, in the fall and the winter. So a lot of students get involved in clubs and different uh, uh, student associations within your programs as well. Uh, so I think when you come to Laurentian, you'll almost be overwhelmed by how many opportunities there are to get involved with different recreational leagues like the intramural sports. Uh, all the way to uh, like uh, as a management student, for example, we have our management student council, which you can get involved directly with your faculty and your dean. So definitely a lot of different ways and and to get involved and and uh, you know it can meet the interests of of any st any student for sure. First and foremost, if you do already have your you know uh, a health plan under your parents or under your job at the moment, uh, then you can definitely opt out. So that's first things first. You don't have to pay twice. Uh, but if you do have, um, but if you do use the the health plan under our, our, the associations, um, it'll get you things like uh, you know your regular care, your your regular coverage for uh, you know for glasses, for dental, for uh, you know any medical expenses. If anything, I can actually recommend our website sga age dot com. Uh, so that that you'll find all our information about the healthcare and different opportunities to get involved within our association as well. Uh, so definitely, once you do find out your uh, your association, if you do fall under us, that'll be the, the the best website to go to. And you can also email us directly if you have any further questions about uh, you know how to get involved or the different services we offer as well.